Really? Yeah, I, I, I mean, it's, it's just something I'm not used to. You know, I've never been used to missing a game. I've never been used to uh, uh, not being able to be available for my teammates. Um, the, the good thing is I, I've had experience in my career where I wasn't able, I was able to play, but, you know, wasn't as talented as my other teammates, and I was too young. So I've been able to sit on the bench and understand how to be a great cheerleader. So um, and how important it is to be that person for the team. So. Uh, I just tried to do that, you know. Uh, you know, it's been a it's been a blessed three days. I mean, you know, just to be here talking to y'all and being able to do what I'm doing is a, is a blessing. So, uh, you know, accident could have went. I would say I had five percent of chance of making it out alive. I hit the five percent mark, and then I'd say four percent was to be seriously injured, and one percent was to be minorly injured. And I came out with the one percent, so it's not bad. I mean, you really think that, I mean, as that semi hit, I mean, you thought you saw your life kind of flash before your eyes there? Nah, it happened too quick. I didn't know what the hell hit me, so I was kind of, like, confused. But um, it was simple. I mean, we, we car in front of us stopped to uh, react to an accident that just occurred in front of him. We stopped, uh, and we stopped not hard, but, you know, gradually and a little more than gradual. But, and then we came to more of a hard stop, and we stopped. And I looked at our trainer, Kurt, who I'm glad is safe as well, and looked at him and complained about the car in front of us stopping so hard and uh, I didn't realize what he said until after that he was saying oh, the truck is not slowing down behind us so he was real stone faced <laughs> looking at me so uh, at the rear view mirror so I didn't know what he was talking about I kept talking about the car in front of us the next thing you know we got hit it happened so quick so um, you know I'm just glad glad uh, everyone's safe in the accidents uh, everyone's alive um, you know, obviously, like I said, it could have been much worse, you know. And in all honesty, probably should not have uh, made it out like I did, but uh, glad I did. So the truck was going essentially highway speed, just hadn't really noticed what was going on? Or was it breaking when it hit you? It was going reasonable. <laughs> so, uh, um, you know, um, if, I, if I had to make a guess, I'd say probably, mm, I'll say like, 35 to 45, mm -hmm. you know, probably in that range. So it, was, it was moving. And, you uh, guys were both in front of We were at a dead stop, so right. usually I think it counts as times two because you're at a dead stop. But we, uh, it was it was, it was pretty cool. It was pretty gnarly. I know why, but uh, um, like I said, I'm just blessed, you know. I, You never know, uh, you know, like Tyus and them said and stuff like that, you know. I'm just glad my teammates were behind me, uh, you know, really wished the best for me. and. Uh, uh, I still make jokes to Todd about every day about how he saw me in this crazy car wreck and just kept driving to the airport. <laughs> he didn't want to get a fine or something. He tried to help me out. So, uh, and, you know, it's just funny. It's all funny games. It's, it's I told Kirk this many times. It's all good to make jokes when you uh, when no one gets hurt. So it's uh, pretty uh, yeah, it's fun. Carl, what, what made you want to get on the flight to New York after such a crazy experience there? Man, I. Um, I went, you know, got in the rack and everything. Um, you know, I didn't want to, um, when uh, they asked me, you know, we're going to bring an ambulance for you to take you to the hospital and stuff, I, I just didn't want to make that big of a scene and anything like that, especially being on a highway and, and everything like that and status. So I didn't want to do that. I just admit it, took myself, you know, found a way to take an alternate route to the hospital. Got admitted right away. Uh, you know, got checked out, was there for some hours, and then, uh, you know, um, as soon as they gave me the green light, you know, the first thing, you know, uh, they say, hey, you know, you got to really take it easy and stuff like that. I just said, yeah, great doc, you know, appreciate you. And as soon as I left, I called the wolf and said, yo, what's the latest flight I could get out? So, so I found out the latest flight. Um, found a way to get to my teammates. You know, I just, you know, regardless of what was going to happen, 